So um, I will begin with the uh, impulse speech, a brief Im impulse speech. I'm Eric Vico, I'm professor at uh, Medical University in Paris, and I'm in charge of the uh, clinical trial unit of uh, APHP, as well as the uh, Center for Evaluation of Medical Devices. I'm biophysician and a methodologist of clinical trials. First, I'd like to, to present some uh, characteristics of APHP. Uh, we have a very large platform of hospital in Paris. Uh, they are grouped in uh, one individual structure, that is APHP, and uh, we are the first academic university for medicine in France. And as you can see here, we have uh, more than 10 million of patients each year in uh, the different hospitals. We have also uh, 7.5 million of euro of uh, annual budget. We are the first promoter of uh, clinical trials at the uh, European level. And take everything together, we represent almost 10% of all hospitalization in France. This is also a very important site for clinical research, and I'm personally involved in clinical research. This, as you can see, it's more than 40% of all clinical research made in France. So if you compare the level of uh, hospitalization on the level of clinical research, you can see that we are very much focused on clinical research. We have here the number of uh, every publication in uh, uh, last years. And what is also important, and this is the meaning of the message today, is that we have really uh, a very strong interest in partnerships with all actors regarding health research. That means obviously medical doctors, but also engineers, data scientists, industrial partners, financial partners. This is uh, very important regarding the uh, intellectual property. We have a very large department for intellectual properties. And uh, this is also uh, something that concerns both drugs and medical devices. This is more or less uh, pictures of uh, all the ecosystem where we are uh, at this time. And obviously, uh, medicine is a very important partner for this uh, ecosystem. We want to develop this ecosystem. We, we want to develop the connection between these uh, partners. And uh, I'm absolutely convinced that at this time, APHP should be uh, the uh, first platform for health development in Europe. With all these patients, we have the possibility uh, to uh, make a large number of research. So, when I consider this, uh, this is obviously very, I will say, uh, a very uh, uh, good view of what is APHP. But I, I think that the challenges for us are also very uh, important. So, what are these challenges at this, uh, at this time? We have medical doctors. But we have also engineers. Do they speak together? We hope so. But we have to develop the communication, the partnerships between engineers and medical doctors. We try very hard to do so by different procedures, but we have to develop these aspects. There is another aspect. We have here uh, the possibility to have inventors coming from the hospital and they want to promote, to develop their own startups. We have to make the connection between people inventing some innovations within the hospital and engineers 
and partnerships with financial uh, partners in order to develop this. We have also, I will say, very important challenges regarding data collection. What will I would like, really, is to have a research hospital where every patient coming in the hospital can be identified and we can know if this patient can or cannot benefit, for, for instance, from an innovation or from a clinical trial that can help him with its disease. At this time, we don't have this type of products. We need this type of products because you should know that it's very, very difficult for medical departments when they see patients to identify if these patients can go, can enter, can be included in one of the trials that can be done uh, in uh, APHP. It's very difficult. We need to know very quickly if a patient can benefit or not of a clinical trial uh, where uh, APHP, for which APHP is a, That's one thing. The other thing is that we have different systems of data collection. In APHP, we have recently developed a large data hub, data warehouse, in order to collect in the same place all the data regarding patients hospitalized in APHP. That's very good. That's very challenging. That's very good. We can collect the data of the patients. But some data are not collected. For instance, we are developing, and you are developing also, many connected objects, many connected medical devices. There is a big challenge in order to collect the data issued from the medical devices. For instance, in the operating room, in the intensive care unit, and to implement this in the same database as the all, all the other uh, parameters of the patients. That's a big challenge for us. This is very important. That's one thing. The other thing is that, as a clinical trialist, I like to have the patients in the hospital, and I, be, I will be able to collect the data of his patients, yes. But when the patient goes out of the hospital, I cannot follow these patients. I cannot take the data of these patients and include this data in my clinical trials. This is another very important challenge. That's all the challenge regarding interoperability of the different data collection system. And I really think that it will be a crucial point to develop the research hospital in the next years. So, that's one of the aspects that are very, very challenging. The other aspects regarding interior operability is the fact that we should involve patients. We should involve associations of patients. Association of patients should be informed of what happened in the hospital. In the hospital, different trials can be important for the different patients' associations. At this time, we don't have the appropriate connection, rapid, easy connection with the patients in order for the patients to be able to be informed of what happened in the hospital. So it will also be a very important challenge for us. I will, um, I will finish uh, in order to, to just to say that what is also important is that information between the different actors of health are very fluid. For instance, uh, as I am a consultant for, for, for different startups, for instance, I see very brilliant ideas. But these brilliant ideas maybe will not be a success because the medical need is not present. So it's crucial to have the interaction between doctors defining the medical needs and the engineers and the inventors in order to provide the appropriate solution, but appropriate solutions for real problems. So that's very important. The other key question is the fact that our inventors, for instance, are helped by the institution, but 
As you know, there is a critical problem is the time of medical evaluations. And we have to be very, very active, proactive, in order to favorize, in order to help people to make appropriate medical evaluation of their ideas. So with this, I will say, this landscape, I will finish saying that we, all the people in APHP, are very much convinced and are very much involved in the fact that APHP should be, should be a very important platform for medical evaluation of drugs, of therapeutic strategies, of personalized medicine, and of medical devices for the next year. So, don't hesitate to contact people from APHP, both for expertise, for your trials, and for discussion. Thank you very much for your attention.